the following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 290 pounds, the Animal Batista! I cannot believe the WWE Universe's reaction to Batista. This guy takes time out of his busy movie star schedule to return to WWE, and they've given him nothing but disrespect. You have to respect the animal. the place Cena. John Cena he may be the face that runs the place cold but it sounds to me like the crowd is split on John Cena Batista was part of a tremendous class in WWE's developmental system that included Brock Lesnar, Randy Orton, and John Cena. Both the Animal and Cena won their first world championships at WrestleMania 21. Batista and Cena truly were on a collision course since day one. And when Batista won the 2005 Royal Rumble, it was Cena he eliminated to win the match. Man, this card is just packed with so many great matches. And this one is definitely among the most anticipated, I'd say. I wish I didn't, but I must agree about Cena and Batista. It's a tale of parallel careers, gentlemen. Brute strength versus raw power. Let's remember something, fellas. It was Batista who broke John Cena's neck. Well, Cena brutalized Batista to the extent that the animal quit WWE for four years. Anytime those two are in the ring together, they're both looking to punish each other. Nailed it. John Cena is starting to take some deep breaths in there. Ouch. He's going to want to make sure this doesn't snowball out of control. Yeah, oh, he's man. taking on some offense here, but that's to be expected, especially considering who he's in the ring with. You see more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think he still has plenty of fight left in it. I wonder if John Cena knew his career would change forever when he put on a rapper costume for SmackDown's Halloween party in 2002. But he showed he can spit rhymes, and it worked to get the attention of his opponents. So the doctor of thugonomics was born.
Byron brought up Cena's study of thugonomics. Even though he had early success showing ruthless aggression, Cena had hit a rough patch and was in real danger of getting lost in the fold before he discovered his affinity for rap. In the years that followed, Cena very effectively used his impressive rhymes to rile up enemies, ascend to the main event, and win championships. You gotta believe this one's over! Oh! Oh, right to the face! And now it's John Cena getting pushed to the limit. You'll often see the words never give up on John Cena's clothing, and he truly lives by those words. Cena has spent over 15 years working hard to be the best, and he'll never quit on the WWE Universe. I'm kind of astonished that as long as Cena's been around, we rarely see him take shortcuts. Heck, the guy literally won't quit. He'd rather pass out in pain than admit defeat and tap out. I'm not giving up on the conversation about John Cena. That phrase, never give up, has inspired so many of Cena's fans. Terminally ill children, members of the military, Cena fights hard so that they can fight even harder. Yeah, you have to be inspired by a guy with Cena's work ethic. He's fighting harder now than he was when he was a rookie. Nobody can doubt Cena when he utters those three words. Power slam! Good night! Got the shoulders down. Gets the shoulder up! Wow! to the this might be it oh my John Cena is in quite a bind there may be no coming back from this I know he doesn't have any quit in him but now might be one of those times where you take the loss and live to fight another day if anyone can make a big comeback you know it's John Cena oh. <laughs> Here's the cover for the win, and Batista pops the shoulder up. Gonna take a whole lot more. Look out, John Cena is full of impact. Are we looking at yet another John Cena victory here? Oh man, Batista's in trouble now. He's looking a little off bat. He leaves no doubt right there. He's always had great stamina. See if it lasts here. Destroy your face. Are we looking at yet another John Cena? We got a cover. One. Digging deep for a kick out. Remarkable. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. He's lining him up. He's looking at it. Batista turns it around. Here comes Spear. Incredible. This one. It Here's the cover. And an ear fall. And the Cena Nation doing everything they can to keep John Cena in this match. It's called the Cena Nation, Byron. One word. Batista Bomb. Will he be victorious? Kick out of two. Oh, that may have been a slow count. Wow. That's pure power, guys. Batista Bomb! Cover! Cover! What a win for Batista! Now let's take a look back at these guys in action. Overall, this match was average at best. But not every match is going to be memorable. In fact, I've almost forgotten it happened already. Some pretty good give and take in this match, as these highlights show. The superstars in this one got after it pretty good from the opening bell. Can't complain about the effort, technical proficiency, or result here. here is